It's just a bot. Mine. Mine? Go show Grandma. You want to show Grandma the predator? Hey guys, welcome to Find Me Toys again. I am your host, Dan the Man, and now that we know at the time of this recording, another Predator movie is coming out next year on 2022 called Prey. What perfect timing, baby. If you don't know, I'm a huge Predator fan. Went to my local Walmart. I've been looking for these things, and we have a treat for you. Boom. Boom. Predator figurines. Uh, the exclusive Walmart Predator figurines. I'm so excited. Not only do I have these two, I have, of course, the Jungle Predator from the first movie. Uh, this is a Walmart exclusive. Uh, this is so cool. This is the, the Lucent kind of uh, cloaking figurine. And then I also have the Berserk. Um, I am not going to open these two because I do want to keep them in the box, but I have a third one that I uh, was going to give to my son for Christmas, but I couldn't help it. We're getting them other toys for Christmas, a, a nice, really cool Turbo Man doll, which that video will be coming out later. But I'll showcase his Predator that I bought him, and this is like his first Predator figurine, so I'm super excited. Uh, I'm a huge Predator fan, and I know he's going to love Predator later on down the road, but I thought it's a cool figurine to give him, and I'll explain why you should not give uh, the uh, other accessories to these guys if you have a child, um, but I think I'll showcase his Predator figurine for you. But before we get to that, let's just showcase real quick these two figurines that I have right here. Okay, first up is the Berserk Predator. Now, if you, I, I love Predators, the film, and I thought, you know, like, I wish they would do a continuation of that adaptation. Uh, it's a really cool concept, especially at the end of that film. But what I really loved was how they kind of made these guys the cousins of the original, They we call them, and they're known as the Yaucha. But, you know, every public or general audience knows these guys as the Predator. But they made them basically the cousin. They're bigger, stronger, and they, they're freaking meaner. Their face is a little bit different. Uh, I think they look look thousand times better than the freaking uh, Ultimate Predator that was in the last Predator movie. But this is the Berserk. And what's cool is he gets like a little cannon right there. It actually does tell you uh, it's uh, the Berserker from Predators. Uh, look at, I know the coloring is definitely different than the actual film, but I think that's pretty cool. I mean, it's an action figure, it's a figurine, you know, and I do like, you know, when they change it up a little bit. If I wanted the exact Berserker Predator, I would, I would go to NECA, and NECA always has these awesome figurines. But I definitely got the Berserker Predator, and it tells you, like, a lot of information in the back and stuff. Uh, these guys, I don't know, I thought these guys would be 25 These guys were only $10. And I'll show you why that's a deal in a minute. But this is the Berserker Predator. Uh, he, I love the helmet. That's what what I love about the Berserker helmet or the Berserker Predator. He has his uh, wrist blades, which are longer than the original Predator. What I thought was kind of interesting was the feet. Look at the feet. <laughs> his his little uh, his like uh, metal kind of shoes, which his he has bigger toes than the other Predators, which I'll showcase the next one and show you the difference between this one. And, and this one, look at the feet. The feet is, the, he doesn't have the metal thing going on right here. This is the original Predator. Uh, it's a little bit more skinnier. So this one is really cool. This is the original Predator from the Predator movie, but this one has a, like a little uh, uh, a lucent kind of, uh, and then it has like the cloaking kind of skin. Uh, the original helmet. The uh, This one comes with uh, the, like a little, the spear, but that's kind of weird because it's like Predator 2 kind of spear. Uh, and then also you have the, the wrist blades, which are longer as well. Uh, but the helmet is where, where it's all about. I would like them to make the AVP versions because I do like the Celtic Predator. And the Celtic Predators are bulkier. But I haven't seen them come out with that just yet. Uh, I love the shoulder cannon. The shoulder cannon is awesome. 
But yeah, this is the original Predator. I think they have another version of this one, but with his helmet off. I know they have the like the Ultimate Predator with the helmet off, but uh, for this line of series, they have three. So those were the first two. Let me showcase the third one. So this is the third one's box. This is actually, dude, this is City Predator, Predator 2. I gave this to my son already, he opened it up. Uh, you have to see the back, this is the Predator 2 box. Now let's showcase him and why this is, this is such a steal. If you see these Predators at Walmart, I don't know if it was just a, a miscalculation on the 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 pricing because i see these things going for at least like 20 bucks or 25 or even more but this was only 10 dollars. i'm going to showcase why that is a deal and the steal the showcase predator 2 city hunter okay so this is predator 2 city hunter uh this is definitely so this is outside the box my son already opened it. this is his predator figurine i wanted to get him i think i'll go back and buy uh, another one in box, but this is outside the box that he opened. I told him he could go. Uh, this is his heart. This is his toy, man. Very cool. Look at the shoulder cannon, man. Look at that shoulder cannon, baby. The shoulder, the shoulder cannon is so awesome. This is why I gave my son this predator. Because I think the City Hunter Predator, Predator 2's Predator, has one of the best designs out of all the Predator films. The helmet alone has a little bit more detail. The coloring of this particular Predator than the other ones is a lot better. You have the yellow and then you have like this info red kind of uh, color to it. The, the wrist blades, normal size, not as long as the other ones. Now what I really love, I always look for for Predator figurines, is the dreadlocks. Now it's not super detailed, they're not, uh, it's not like you could, uh, they're all attached, they're not individual, like uh, some of the Predator figurines I've seen, but it's really cool for $10, man. For $10, this thing, look at the articulation, man. The articulation, the arms, look at that. It bends, the, the actual forearm bends. The articulation is absolutely amazing on this thing. And for $10, I mean, you get toys, you get like those big Marvel, like Spider-Man, like all the Avengers toys, and they don't move like this. They don't move like this. Look at the body, back and forth, the head, up and down. Very good articulation. And it, is, it feels not, it doesn't feel, it's gonna take a lot to really break this figurine. Look at this. Now, even the feet, the feet are really good in articulation too. I love the feet, look at. The feet has great, cool detail, a lot more skinnier out, more out there uh, with the nails than the other two. So what's cool about this Predator, it has a little built, or has something where you could put in right here on its side, and I'm gonna showcase that right now. Uh, but this is very, very articulate. Look, you could hear it. This is a really cool figurine. It's very sturdy too. So this is the front, the back of it, very a uh, little bit bulky on the on the shoulders area. This is This is awesome, man. Okay, so this is, I'm gonna showcase why you should just give your kid the Predator, but don't give him the accessories if you're a little worried about this certain aspect to it. So here are the accessories. This is the, uh, this is actually his uh, spear. Uh, if you remember, Predator 2 had, uh, the, the Predator had the spear. He used this uh, a lot for his weaponry. Now the reason why I didn't give my son this is because, a little bit pokey. Not crazy sharp, but I just really don't trust uh, younger kids to have something like this because you just never want to take the chance of them tripping, it catching on their eye or anything like that. So I did not give him the spear. I thought, listen, when he gets a little bit older, if he still loves the Predator figurine, we'll give him the spear. But uh, for me, uh, there's not too much detail on it. I wish there was a little bit more detail on the spear. But like I said, for $10, you get accessories, including the awesome figurine. Uh, like I said, very, very cool. We'll put this on him in a minute because I'm going to show you the second accessory that it comes with.
Now this one I gave him, this is the actual uh, disc that he that the Predator throws. This is one of his, one of the most, more iconic weaponry because it goes like a boomerang that come back, it's sharp, it, it, die, it has that infamous moment where it takes out <clears throat> keys and like his, his lower body drops but his upper body stays and there's nothing to hold him up like that so it's very weird. Uh, I gave my son this one because he doesn't put anything in his mouth. He's a... Uh, I know he's gonna lose this <laughs> in due time, so this is probably gonna be the last time you see this ever. But uh, for if you are worried and uh, kids, you you know your kid puts in stuff in their mouth or whatever, then don't give them it. But my son doesn't do that, so I just know he's gonna lose this. But this is the uh, the disc, and we're gonna showcase where this goes. So I think it's really cool. So here is the where it should go. Boom! That is dope, man. That is dope. This is a very cool free ring. So let's get the spear going on here. Oh, the spear, baby, the spear. Oh, yeah, right. Oh, dude, rocking right there. Oh, pretty. Yeah, yeah. Dude, this is awesome. This is an awesome figurine. You can find this at Walmart. Uh, they do have the Alien series as well. So you got some Xenomorphs, but I am a huge Predator fan. I wanted a predator uh i i bought this for my son uh, i was trying to figure out which one he would probably like best i thought this was the coolest one i gave him this one he got to open it up he he, he loves it i just took it for a little bit he's asleep right now but i'm gonna give it back to him just to showcase you the figurine and what it's like because all uh, both the figurines are going to be just like this articulate it's not going to have the disc uh, it's some of them don't have the spear. I'm surprised this one has two accessories like the berserk only has I think one thing and then also the the uh, cloaked predator, but they're very awesome. I'm gonna keep those two in the box because uh, those are mine. I love collecting predator stuff. I'll probably go back to Walmart and get him in the box for myself. Um, it, it, it's $10, man. I don't know if that was just a price uh, mix up, but for $10, I've seen, I have seen figurines for 10 bucks that are pretty, they're about this size. Uh, but I don't think they have the articulation and kind of the detail that this particular one has. Out of all of the three, I think my son's got the best one. It's the City Predator, but you can't go wrong with any Predators. So if you see these guys at Walmart and you're a big Predator fan or you like figurines, I do highly recommend pick it up. It's only $10. I mean, if you're a collector, these are absolutely gorgeous collectibles. Thank you guys. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. would really appreciate that. Just hit the big red button. Come join this channel. We have more videos to come. Like the video too. will help the algorithm of the YouTube game. It gets this channel to keep going. And then also uh, just comment below. Let me know if you guys picked up these figurines and if you guys enjoy them. And if you're a Predator fan like myself and you're trying later on and when your son get, or daughter gets older, trying to get them into the movies. Uh, once my son reaches at a certain age, I will show him the movie, or at least the first movie. The second movie is way too violent. Uh, but I, I'm, a, I'm a huge Predator fan, and I, I know he's not scared of the Predator. I have a lot of Predator figurines, so he does know his dad likes Predator. His dad likes these uh, this, this creature that Stan Winston and his team created. R.I.P. Stan, you did an amazing job. Until the day I die, the probably Predator, the first movie, would probably be one of my favorites of all time. It is one of my favorites of all time, until the day I die. So, thank you guys. I'm Dan, the man, a.k.a. Daniel's son. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.